it's May 2nd, Monday, May 2nd. I move out tomorrow and I'm very, very excited. Um, my roommate, my roommate is gone as you can tell. This is all my stuff. Um, but I've moved some things around just so I could clean better. And I'm in the midst of removing my lights. I've already taken like a ton of stuff to my car and it's just really sad. It's kind of a sad moment, but honestly, I'm really excited to leave because I don't think I've gotten a full night's sleep. Well, I'm probably back, but I'm actually just really excited to leave because I don't think I've gotten a full night's sleep here the entire year. So I'm just ready to get out. Um, I'm just going to be cleaning for the rest of the day. I don't know what time it is. What time is it? I've taken like all my lamps and stuff and it's going to be weird. But it's 1.30 right now and I may take another move to my car just to get some more stuff out of here. But really the only stuff I have left is my desk, my bed, and that's it. So it's kind of sad. But... That means I'm going home and I get to see like my family and I get to see my cat and I get to see all my friends and it's going to be great. I'm not going to miss this as much as I probably should. <laughs> so as you know, today is Monday, May 2nd and I'm moving out tomorrow and I'm so excited and I filmed this clip a little earlier but it didn't turn out the way I wanted. You couldn't hear me and it just wasn't good and so I thought I'd refilm it. Um, I'm currently sitting in front of our window because we have great natural light and it is overcast today we have such a pretty view and it's overcast which means the lighting is great and i thought i'd just talk to you guys about what's been going on in my life this semester and all that because i haven't talked to you guys literally since december which is insane i am finishing up my freshman year here at the university of south carolina which i do love I was very skeptical skeptical about coming here because none of my friends came here and it was a weird experience like dropping everything and just being the only person I know here and it really taught me a lot about myself which in the end looking back at this year it it was not what I expected it to be in the slightest it wasn't all late night food runs and late night movies and all this stuff and doing all of these things with amazing friends and all this stuff like honestly this year was really tough for me and that's expected i don't expect anything less because for me it takes a while for me to transition into new places and new things and i did the same thing in high school my freshman year of high school i was very very like I didn't get involved in anything and I just felt out of place and I feel like that's the way this year has gone. Classes have been great. I have loved like almost every class I've taken and I've done well in almost every class I've taken which is more than I could ask for and I think because I came in with such a different mindset than a lot of other people like this wasn't my first taste of being away from my parents and being able to do whatever I wanted like this was. I don't know it just seemed very natural to me i am not the kind of person that wants to go out and party all the time and wants to get drunk and wants to do all this stuff like honestly i would rather just sit in here and watch a movie or do something creative or there's a bird flying do you see it oh no we miss it um do something creative or like write a blog post like i am very not like a going out type person um so that was hard getting adjusted to that culture because that's what my floor revolved around and it was hard for me to get involved in other things because honestly still to this day like if i had a conversation with someone who like i'm not like friends with like all they talk about is drinking and how wasted they got and i'm like can we please have an intellectual conversation like that's all i want <laughs> um but I made one really, really amazing friend, and that's usually the way it goes with me. Like, I don't have this massive friend group. I don't have all these people that I connect with. I have, like, one person or two people, and I found my one person here, and it's really sad because she left, like, last week, and she lives in Iowa, and I'm, I already miss her, but 
that's okay. So, I mean, freshman year has been a great experience. I have learned a lot about myself, which is very important um, because I feel that as you grow older, you need to learn about yourself. You need to know what your aspirations are, what your dreams are, what you want to do with your life. You know, the kinds of people that you want to surround yourself with because if you don't know what you want out of life and you try and get other people involved in your life through like relationships or friendships, like things go south really fast. And I just, I don't know. Um, I'm really excited to leave because honestly, I just want to sleep through the night and I want to not be awoken by drunk people at like 2 a.m. That's my one thing that I cannot wait. I think I'm just going to end the vlog here because honestly I'm not doing anything else today. I'm just going to be sitting right there watching YouTube or doing something because it's like, I, I don't know what time it is here. It's like 4.30 right now and I'm going to eat soon and then I have like two hours before I go to bed, like <laughs> I go to bed early and I'm not doing anything else and it's not a very exciting day today. But my roommate is gone and it's, it's gonna be weird sleeping in here alone <laughs> um but i will talk to you all in a vlog tomorrow when i go home yay